I'm Liz. I'm Julia. And we're the Nolan Twins. Welcome back to Squared. If you're new here, we post new videos every Wednesday. And if you like this video, please give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to Squared down below. So today we're going to be talking to you guys about our experience on Big Brother 17. If you're not familiar with what Big Brother is, it's a reality show on CBS and it's been around for a long time. We were on the 17th season and we were the twin twist. We'll get more into that later, but we're going to talk about our experiences and how crazy of a summer it was. So just to clear the air about one thing, a lot of people think the Big Brother house is, is a mansion. It's actually a house. It's not. It's not. <laughs> it is a studio set at CBS Radford in California. And if you've never seen a studio set, it's basically a rectangle with very high ceilings, dark, cold, and kind of depressing. No windows, nothing. Actually, there were windows, Liz. There were two-way mirrors. Yes. So they would have a camera that would go around the mirrors and someone would record us 24-7. Not only are we on a reality show and they're producing three episodes a week, but there's also these things called the live, live feeds. feeds. And we are watched by live feeders 24 hours a day. That means no privacy. <laughs> Julia and I had a specific task going into the house. We were not just casted as regular house guests. We were brought on as the, the twin, twin twist. twist. Now, what is the twin twist? Julia, take it away. <laughs> We had to switch in and out of the house every two to three days and pretend to be one person. We only had 15 minutes to download each other on all the information that had taken place between the two days that we were in the house. So then when we were done downloading each other, we'd switch outfits and she would go into the house pretending to be Liz. Whoever wasn't in the Big Brother house, they would go to a separate house in the Hollywood Hills. It was a nice big mansion with a beautiful view. A lot of the other house guests thought that one of us was staying in a hotel, but shh, we are actually in a really nice house. So if you guys have any questions about how to get cast on Big Brother, let us know in the comments below and we will be answering them. Another misconception about Big Brother is everyone's always like, oh, you guys get food, do you guys get takeout? takeout, is there a private chef that comes and cooks for you? And the answer is no. Every Friday we would get restocked with groceries and they would put them in the storage room. We had to cook for ourselves every night and that got really annoying because I mean, cooking for yourself is already a mission and a half, but when you have to cook for other people and then live with them, ugh. even though we didn't have our choice of groceries, they would give us a very nice selection. We'd always get chicken, steaks, fish, cookies. <laughs> yeah, well, we also gained a lot of weight, yeah. What we would do to get through the day was a lot of tanning, a lot of pool days. We also did a lot of cleaning because I just got so bored and cleaning would just make me happy. So I cleaned a lot. I did a lot of laundry. A lot of laundry. And if you can imagine living with a sister or a sibling, imagine living with 17 random house guests. It was disgusting so dirty. at times. We had to share one bathroom stall with boys. Ew! Like, Big Brother, why couldn't we have gotten a bathroom stall for girls and a bathroom stall for guys? A lot of people would ask, they don't have like a maid that comes every week. Mm -mm. No, we had to clean the whole house <laughs> ourselves and it got messy. The whole total of our time on Big Brother was 98 days! Can you imagine being without no internet, no phone, no TV? We couldn't even read a book or have a pen to write down stuff. Well, we, could, we could read the Bible. That was the one thing we could read, but the Bible was really boring. So Did you read the Bible? I, I didn't read the Bible. A lot of people think that it was easy for us because we had a sibling on the show but I would say that it made it that much harder. harder. Our stipulation going on the show, we sat down with producers and they said, okay, look, this is the twin twist. What's gonna happen is you have to make it past five evictions as Liz, and if you make it past that fifth eviction, then you can both enter the house as individuals. Not to toot our own horn, but we made it! 
I believe it was like day 65, mm -hmm, around halfway through, and I got to play the game as Julia. So I wasn't Liz the entire summer, which was great because it was so hard pretending to be Liz, but you did an incredible job oh, just, thank you. you know, trying to be Liz because it's, it's really hard. I know, being Liz was really difficult. If you ever want to try out for Big Brother, we highly recommend it, and please feel free to reach out to us. We'll give you some tips and tricks. Also, you have to be 21, and we recommend going to an open audition and sending in a video submission. It's just like a double whammy, and you're more guaranteed to be seen by the producers. Well, guys, thank you so much for listening to our experience on Big Brother 17. Hopefully, you'll see us again on All Stars. It was definitely a summer to remember. If you want to see yesterday's video, click here. And if you want to see more from us, click right over here. We also have a personal channel, and you can find the link to that down below. And if you want to subscribe to Squared, click right over here. And don't forget to comment. We'll see you guys next week. Bye! Bye.